Hi, Mike Stish here for JumpTuck.com. I saw a uh, project where someone had made Conway's Game of Life on a character LCD screen, and they used um, just one character for each pixel. And I thought, you know, we can probably do something a little bit better by using custom characters. Now, originally I wanted to do four pixels per character, but there's only eight spots for custom characters on these HD 44 780 displays. So I ended up just doing uh, two pixels, so just a little box in each character position, and uh, and then you know hooking it up with the Arduino and coding up uh, the Conway's Game of Life rules. Um, I do have one bug that I'll talk about in a second, but let's just go ahead and reset this, and we'll watch it play. looks pretty normal. As I said, there is one bug. I've got something that keeps adding garbage over into this um, column over here. So it looks like it's stable, but then all of a sudden we're going to get this stuff that comes in. So I guess that's nice. It keeps it random. It'll keep going forever like this, um, but it wasn't intentional. Um, one thing to note is I have wrapped the screen. So when a cell is on the very top of um, the seven, or uh, sorry, eight, uh, virtual columns, its neighbor would be column number eight down here. Um, and the same with left and right. It just makes it a little bit, um, I guess it makes it easier to check the neighbors and it also makes it nicer because it keeps going a little bit longer. Uh, of course, all the code will be up um, at my GitHub repository and, uh, you know, further reading at jumptuck.com. Thanks.